channel in today's video I'm going to be showing you guys this new primer that I have that's not actually primer but it's something that can be used as primer and it is under five dollars okay guys so if you want to find out what the product is then keep watching so I have been searching for a primer that kind of does the same thing as the Becca ever matte primer from Becca cosmetics that is like a go-to primer for extremely oily skin, especially in the hotter months. So I live in Houston, Texas. So between March and September, October, I need a primer that's going to keep my face matte when I have makeup on for more than five hours. If I am just like going from the house to church and back home, then really it's not like necessary. But if I'm going from my house to church to brunch to my friend's house like I need a primer that's going to hold and while Becca was one of my favorites and it worked so much I didn't feel like spending $40 on primer was something that I wanted to do again like my primer my Becca primer is finished and now I'm looking at different options so most of you guys know Milk of Magnesia works the same way however Milk of Magnesia is terrible for your skin and I think that that was something that I had to come to the realization. I had started using Milk of Magnesia last year when my Becca primer finished and it kind of messed up the texture and consistency of my skin. So I had to stop using it. With that being said, um, I had tried a Rimmel London matte primer. I was trying different matte primers and they just weren't doing the job. Finally, I was searching again on YouTube and I came across something called Cal Calamine Lotion. Um, it's a lotion used as a skin protectant and it also is used to treat poison ivy um, and oak sumac drying lotion. So I saw people using it on YouTube and I was like they were using it instead of using milk of magnesia because this is supposed to be a lot better for your skin because it is a skin protectant. So this is the product. I got the Walmart brand. It was $1.84. This one is the pink one. They do have a clear one as well that's like $2.98. So I think I'll try that one out next. But this is what I'm going to be using today on my skin. Let me get my little wedges. So I'm going to be using my wedge applicators to apply this product. Let me see if there's a cover on it. No, there's no cover on it. It is pink, just like the bottle. Um, it kind of reminds me of like Pepto-Bismol. what the lotion looks like again so you guys can see I'm gonna apply it I've already um primed my well, not primed my skin I've already put on my SPF because to test this out I am going to be going out today I'm going to take photos and I'm going to um go to the like the outlet mall and I just want to do like a wear test to see how it goes the sun is out today it's going to be warm in Houston Texas So really, I only get oily, like really oily on my forehead and my chin. So really, those are my main areas. But I'm just going to apply it all over my face because it is, again, a skin protectant. So um, I hope I don't look too ashy with this because I already have on my moisturizer, which has SPF in it. I'm just going to rub that in and let it dry down. I probably won't put makeup all the way up here because my hair is going to be in the way anyway. So I'll probably just stop my makeup like right here. So that is what it looks like.
This is how it's looking. Cute. See the fun little curls. So I'm about to go to the mall. Right now it is 11. It just turned 11. Let me give you guys in front of the window how it looks. Okay, so that's how it's looking. So I'm going to check back in around, let's see, 11, 12, 1, two hours. So around one o'clock so I can kind of show you guys how it's looking. very natural and refreshed it's 108 so I've had my makeup on for two hours now I am back home went to the outlet mall did a little bit of shopping with my mom and sister so I applied I finished applying my makeup at 10 45 I just looked at the what time I recorded the video and right now it is 5 45 so Let's say 11, 12, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. We'll say seven and a half hours. Seven and a half hours, guys. And this is what my skin looks like. Like, seriously? Seriously, I could still wear this makeup out. Like, it's definitely oils, but it's not, like, super oily. Let me sit down so you guys can get an idea of what we're really looking like here. Okay. So, this is what I look like compared to what I looked like when I first put on my makeup. Of course, when I first put on my makeup, it was like completely matte and powdered. Now I've worn the makeup. I've walked outside where it was hot. Um, it wasn't super hot, but it was still hot and humid. Guys, I think I just found my new primer. Like, I don't see anything else beating this. One, because it's only like $2.00. Two, it literally, not only does it go on well, my skin, like, it feels like it's protecting my skin. Like, it, it feels nice on my skin. It feels like I just, I don't know. Even my skin looks, like, a little bit softer and, like, like, I don't know, like, retouched or something. I don't know. Like, it definitely, like, hides my pores. Now you can see them a little bit more because I'm getting a little bit oily, but, like, I don't know like I really like this primer guys so that's it if you have oily skin I would definitely recommend you try this again try the calamine lotion I'm gonna show you guys one more time this is what it looks like of course I got the Walmart brand because it was cheap but you can get any brand they're cheap no matter what you won't spend more than six dollars which is amazing so you can save the 30 or 40 dollars you use on primer to buy primer on something else so that's really good so yeah guys i'm so glad you guys watched this video i hope you guys enjoyed it and i hope you guys decide to try out this product as a first face primer so until next time i will see you guys in my next video bye guys